this was actually almost 15 inches when I cut it. Hi there, people of the interweb. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new to this channel, hi, how are you? I'm Kachi and I create content around natural hair, beauty, lifestyle, content creation with a little bit of everything else in between. So please consider subscribing, okay? By hitting the big red subscribe button that is below and notification bell besides. So if you're new to this channel, welcome back. Welcome back home, okay? So guys, wait first. Wait first. I think it should be like the first hair video I'm filming in 2021. But it might not go up first, yeah? But if it doesn't go up first, eh? So bad, but happy new year, okay? Welcome to 2021. 2020 was a hard year already, but 2021 must be soft in Jesus' name. Amen, okay? So in today's video, I'm going to be updating you guys about my natural hair growth challenge. So without further ado, you know how we do. Let us get right into the video. For those that don't know, yeah, I'm doing a hair growth challenge throughout the whole of 2021. I hope, oh, amen, amen. And I've played a video about it linked here or here. I really don't know. I put a video about it like a few days ago, so you can always check the video out to like get details of the whole hair growth challenge. Okay, but for this video, I'm going to be just be doing a length check and sharing with you guys like the products I'm going to be using in my hair for like my own first few weeks of the hair growth challenge. Okay, so I have my products here, so let's us just jump right into it. The first I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be preparing my hair with oils. Like I already have my DIY oil um, infusing somewhere. Okay, but. If you don't know like the oil I'm using, I'm going to be using sunflower oil as my base oil and just a couple of herbs inside, okay? So you can always check out my, I think I have a pre pool video. I'm going to have it linked here or here. I think I have one, I'll probably link it linked here or here. So that in case you don't like know the oil to use and everything, you can just check that video out, okay? After which I'm going to be shampooing my hair. I'm going to be using two shampoos, guys. The first one is going to be, not two shampoos at once. Okay, not two shampoos at once. Just one at a time. I'm going to be going with my Pantene Natural Shea Water Sulfate Free Creamy Cleansing Shampoo because it's actually almost done. It's like here. So this will last me like two or three washes before it checks out. Yeah, after which, once it's done, I'm going to start going in with my Cantu Sulfate Free Cleansing Cream Shampoo. Like this is actually the same thing. They are both sulfate free, cream cleansing, shea water, the same thing. Okay, so I'm going to be going with these two shampoos for like the first weeks of my hair growth challenge. Like just these two. I hope I can go in with just this. I know me, I like shampooing my hair, but hopefully I'll only go in with this two, okay? After shampooing my hair, I'm going to be deep conditioning my hair. I'm going to be going in with the Pantu Naturals. Um, let me get to this. I'm back. The Pantu Naturals Deep Conditioning Cholesterol Treatment, this one. What I'm going to be using to be conditioned is usually going to be, is there going to be this um, cholesterol treatment or a mayonnaise? I'm not, I don't think I'm going to use any other thing else. Just anything that is like protein based, mayo or cholesterol, mayo or cholesterol for my hair at this point. I'm just trying it out to just see how my hair would react to like constant mayonnaise or cholesterol treatment. Okay, so I'm going to be going with this deep conditioner mixed with like a couple of Ayurvedic powders. So I'm going to be going with two powders, Amla and Hibiscus powder, just those two first. Why? Because I don't want to overdo it. Basically, I'm going to just be going with like, I have a lot of powders here. You can check out my Ayurvedic powder haul here, where I talk about like different powders and like how to use them in your hair. But I'm going to just be going with Amla and Hibiscus first, till they are done. When they're done, I'll not switch up to like probably Shika Kai, then I'll switch up to, I'll not switch up to Brami, like that, like that, like that. I don't want to be mixing everything at once, just a few at it, like just a few, one or two at a time, okay? After deep conditioning my hair with this and the powders, I would go in with like it. I would add, I would do a tea rinse for like the whole of January. Yes, I've been doing tea rinses like constantly for the whole of January in my hair. I'm also going to have my DIY tea rinse or DIY tea video linked here. I hope I have enough cards to link these things. Okay, if I don't, please check in the description box. Yeah, so once we're going in with my tea in my hair after every wash day throughout the month of January, probably in February I'll switch it up to like rice water. Then in March I switch it up to something else. Okay, but for this January I'm going to be going in with my DIY series constantly okay so when it comes to twisting my hair or styling my hair or product styling my hair i'm going to be going in with my Cantu curling cream because i don't know what i said it in my other um, hair growth challenge video that curl creams just give your hair like more moisture than using a leave-in conditioner and a butter to like twist or to style i don't know the chemistry behind i don't know the exact in ingredients probably this has i don't know this has a lot of oils guys this has a lot this has silicones i don't know i don't know i don't know the chemistry but this keeps my hair moisturized longer than leave-in conditioner and butter. So I'm going to be going with curl cream. This curling cream to be twisting my hair, to be styling my hair. After for, for my scalp care, 
I'm meant to be going with a scalp oil, yeah. I even have like scalp oils, or I made like six bottles of oils for this challenge for like the whole year. But if this is just a tip for my people that always have acne and that like oil always drips down their face and causes them to have irritations. Personally, I'm going to be going with this hair wonder scalp or um rich daily moisturizer and repair cream something, okay. I added, I added like a few drops of peppermint oil to this, like concentrated peppermint oil to this, and I like whisked it all up so that like it will have like extra peppermint effect. And I've been using this in my hair, you guys can see. Like I'm not even jonesing with this. I've been using this in my hair. I actually apply it on my scalp almost daily, like no jokes. So I'll be going in with this in my hair because I don't want oil dripping down my face, and because I usually like moisturize my hair and oil my scalp in the night, so I don't want oil like just staying everything. So I've been using this constantly. Because I'm mostly at home right now. If school is done, I go back to using oils in my hair because I'm more active in school. But now that I'm at home, let me just stay true to what I know that would work. So this is actually very nice. And this is actually very affordable. I think it's like 500. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know. It should be between 500 and 1,000 naira. I don't know how vendors are selling me these days. But when it, when it first came out, it was like 500 naira. But now I don't know how much they're selling it for. So this has a lot of good ingredients. It has rosemary, lavender, biotin, lemongrass. So I'm biology count names. You know me, I'm biology. Me and chemistry and why exists. Me and biology with the host. <laughs> so sunflower oil, castor oil, coconut oil, neem, ginger, garlic, olive oil, curry leaf powder. Just a couple of good stuff, guys. So I had peppermint oil for like the extra tingling effect. Okay. So that is all that I'm going to be using in my hair for like the first few weeks of the hair growth challenge. Okay. If there's any update, I will be updating you guys on my Instagram. So actually follow me on Instagram at Natural Kachia. And on my natural hair group chats, yeah. If you want to know more about that, check the first natural hair group challenge video, okay? So right now, let's just go ahead and do a length check. Let's just check how long is this baby? How long has this baby grown? And then I'll come back to end the video. Okay, guys, time for a length check, okay? I'm going to be checking the left back, right back, left side, right side, and front and center of my head. I'm going to be using a ruler, a 12-inch ruler. Because my hair, I don't think it's over 12 inches. I, I cut it from like 14, 13 to 15 inches back to 12. So it's not over 12 inches. I'm quite sure of that. Okay, so I'm going to take down this twist. Yeah, it's just this piece. Okay, so roll on my scalp and drag my hair through. It's somewhere like 11 inches, guys. So this is back to being 11 inches. I'm not used to having hair that's 11 inches. If you know my hair was 11 inches like two years ago and early last year, but this is actually 11 inches. Some parts are not up to 11 inches. Like this won't be up to 11 inches for sure. Okay, this is actually 12 inches. Struggle 12. My hair, I'll just say, keep it at 11. I'll just say it's 11 inches because some parts are over 11 and some parts are less than 11, okay? So let me just go ahead and twist this up. So I'm going to go ahead and write it down in my main unraveled journal because I'm going to be using this religiously for this hair growth challenge. Okay, so left back, 11 inches. Right back, right back. Let's do this. This is my right back. Let me see. It should be almost the same thing. No, my right back should be shorter. It's actually 11 inches also, so... I'm not complaining. So left back and right back. So this is my left left side rather. This side it feels long in my hand though. But it used to be longer. So let me just tangle with my fingers. Ruler. And drag. See, I said it. 12 inches, 12 inches, guys. This is 12. I tried my best to cut it evenly, even though some parts are shorter, but this is a good 12 inch part. This is 12 inches. Let me take you again. My designer for my hair deal. It's like literally the whole the whole ruler. So it's 12 inches. For my left side, it's 12 inches, and I'm proud. This was actually almost 15 inches when I cut it. I was actually surprised that I grew that long, but I'm gonna grow it that long again. Okay, this is my right side. Okay, this should be long, this is longer. 
this should be longer yeah this is over 12 inches i'm keeping it at 12. so this is 12 inches of hair that's nice really nice 12 inches of hair so i have 11 11 12 12. the front will be like i'm just doing a random guest game here the front should be like 11 11 or 12 i don't think i trimmed the front as much so it should be like 12 because it was like they didn't it didn't have any like lots of issues so let me take let me take this one the one that is smaller yes So this is the front of my hair with my nice it's belly level guys let me set it up well hope you guys can see it's actually almost 12 i'm gonna say it's an 11.5 because it's almost 12 but some parts are not up to 12 so it's like an 11.5 which is more like I expected. The last part is the center, so which is around here. So I'm going to just lose in this and take the chunk of hair there. This should be like five inches. <laughs> it should be like five inches. So the ruler on my head, and I'm dragging it. It's here. Guys, 11 inches. I'm kind of very surprised because this part is usually very short. It doesn't feel that long on my hand. But it's 11 inches and I am not mad about it. Okay? So you have 11, 11, 12, 12, 11.5, 11. So my hair basically is 11 inches all around. All around. 11 inches. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tell me the products you're going to be using in your hair for this hair with challenge if you are joining in. Um, tell me the shampoo you're using, the conditioner you're using, the share what are you using just tell me whatever you're going to be using in your hair for the hair coach challenge in the comment section so that i'll like i want to actually steal some things from you okay <laughs> please subscribe to my channel follow me across the social media apart from my natural catchy subscribe 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 follow me follow me follow me and i think i'll see you guys in my next video please remember that god is watching you so give god a beautiful show bye uh, see how she did stand for her corner If you know man, I go like me to call her She say she like up, hey man, look at the color If I forget the name, I go use blue color uh, See how she did stand for her corner If you know man, I go like me to call her She say she like up, hey man